Hey everyone, I wanted to take a moment to update you on some developments. So, you know, we video all kinds of different stuff that we do. And you have seen um, Amy's mom and stepdad in a lot of our videos. Um, her stepdad, Doug, got very sick when they were down, actually on vacation down south. And he had a stroke and he did not recover. So. Um, he actually passed away just a few days ago, and Amy had to fly down to drive her mom and their motorhome back home to Michigan. So they are actually scheduled to arrive here, back at we are where we are camping, within the hour. So I just wanted to let you guys know, um, if you've watched our videos and follow you have seen him in a lot of our summer videos, mostly, when we're out camping and locally. Um, our family's all right. We're figuring things out. He will be dearly missed. So we dedicate this to you, Doug. We love you with all our hearts. Amy just called me and said we're here. We're at the dump station. Oh my God, there they are. Not the fifth wheel. Not this one. Oh, right here. Oh my god. They have been on the road for days. And the motorhome, there she is. The motorhome, this motorhome has no power. It only has power when you plug in to shore power. They have had no power, no lights, no water pump, which no water, nothing. This whole trip back up from Dallas. Here they are. Oh my God, it's so good to see them. There's Amy, taking motorhome to the site. Oh, don't. And here's Mama, she doesn't want to be videoed, but here's the puppies. Got the babies in here. This is Bella in the pink and Bernie back there. Mama's home. Hey RV Journey fans, we are on the road again. Uh, a little different this time. I'm following in our truck and Amy's in front of me driving her mom's motor home. We are finally getting her mom back to home. She's been gone for eight weeks during this whole ordeal and we're finally getting her home. There they are right in front of us. That is a Thor Wind Sport. I believe it's a 30 foot, maybe 31. Amy's driving. Um, it's a 2016 model, very nice inside. So we are having a wiring issue. There's something going on, but we'll be able to figure that out. I think the batteries are dead is what happened. Um, we're gonna get those replaced and see um, if that fixes it. So we are on the road, taking, taking mom back home finally. We are pulling into Terry's house. She left here about eight and a half weeks ago uh, with Doug to go on vacation in Texas to visit her sister whose husband just passed away. Yes, you heard that right. Um, both sisters lost their husbands within about 12 weeks of each other, maybe less. So it was supposed to be a fun vacation it ended up not being fun at all. Well, we got mom back at her house and we are now back at our house because tomorrow is a very special day. It's July 4th and it's Amy G's birthday. July 4th for us always means we get to take our gymnastics kids tumbling in the 4th of July parade here in our town. So we are prepping for that, and I have some insider stuff for you to take a look at. Come on. So we picked up this trailer. Um, we're borrowing it, and we're going to have that all decorated up and everything tomorrow in the Ludington July 4th parade. Plus, i got to show you a secret. Come here, look. Check this out. You're getting an insider view in this giant box. 
what we have. We have all the t-shirts for the kids. Can I show you one? I think I can show you one. It says Flipstar Gym. Summer fun in Ludington. All the kids are going to match tomorrow. Shh, don't tell anybody you saw them first. Hey, we're headed over. There's Abe. Oh, I'm good. Happy birthday. It's hey, it's Abe's birthday. Happy birthday. All right. The trailer's all decorated. We are getting our truck ride over to our parade spot. I love it when it's And you're going to see some tumbling next. Happy to you. Happy birthday, Coke There we are. Flipstar Parade's about to start. We're just taking off. We have so many kids here today. Flipstar kids as far as the eye. How many? I think 52, but there were some moving. It might be more. <laughs> it probably is more. All right. It's going to be a good day, Coach. Well, the trailer is finally undecorated. We are back at the gym, as you can see, and another parade in the books. Hey, look who I have. It's the birthday girl. Happy birthday, Aim. Thanks. Pretty good parade today. Awesome parade. Great turnout. 56 kids, some adults. That's a lot. A lot of kids. Yes, that's a lot of kids for us. I think it might be a record breaker. I think it might be, too. You have a good birthday, though. Good birthday. We have... Restless. Puppies in the back. The natives are restless. We just got back to the motorhome. Yay! Yay. Let's go. <laughs> to journey. It. Let's go. Oh. Gracie's chasing pine cones. You got a pine cone? Let me see that mouth. Oh, you dropped it. Where's your pine cone? Get it. Oh, good girl. Gracie's back there playing. Amy's throwing pine cones and she's getting them. Lila is right here. There's our Lily bear. Lila had the option of coming out of the stroller. Do you think she wanted out of the stroller? No, she wanted to stay in the stroller. Are you girls back? Gracie, what's in your mouth? Got my treasures, Mom. How many? Pine cones do you have, Gracie yeah, Pie? I have lots. You have lots? You're going to go right stroller. into her little crate for the rest of her stroller yes. ride home? Does she have them out? Three of them. No, maybe four. She's a crazy little doggy, isn't she? She's good at cute. play and fetch. Sure is cute. Sure is cute. What you doing there, Aim? Whoa, you just dropped the little screwdriver. <laughs> Um, yeah, get, get this out. I want to hear how loud this is. It's a lot of wiring up there. We're not going to mess with any wiring. We're going to be replacing this cover. And this little screwdriver I dropped is key. Um, we got one of those, one of those, it's called a silencer. I think it just muffles the noise a little bit better. An AC muffler? Yes. <laughs> This little, I got one off here. I gotta get this other one out. We're supposed to just jam this thing up here and pull it out, which of course is always easier said than done. There we go. Alright. So I gotta undo one, two, three, four, five, those six screws. And we're gonna take this facing off. Okay. Okay. What do we have here, Aim? This is what I'm gonna put in today. The RV silencer by Wacko. Wacko. <laughs> Say it again. Wacko. Wacko. <laughs> right here. Here we are. RV AC silencer. Okay, now these are made for Dometic and GE 
RV rooftop mounted air conditioners only. So if your face plate looks like this, this, or this, ours looks like this one, ours is a Dometic, then this is gonna work. Okay, so next I'm gonna take that face plate off and we'll see how this whole process goes. Okay, we have to save. Two of these six screws are supposed to save. So we're gonna save, I'm six saving all them. six. Six. Until we know for sure it's gonna work. Here we go. Down. Old face off. So what's the next step? The next step is we have to, we're gonna end up, we're taping this opening completely off. Where all the cold air comes out? Yeah. So we get the most cold air out of here. So we're and gonna tape it closed. We're actually gonna that tape it. That doesn't really make sense. Closed. Tell no. us about that. It <laughs> it doesn't really make any sense. However, I just called the guy and said, "Hey, so this doesn't number, make sense." What's really cool is the number on that manual on the little instruction guide is a dude named Daryl. <laughs> I'm like, "Hey, Daryl, I have a question for you," and he's like, "Sure, what you got?" So he answered. Um, he answered my question. Why are we blocking off? the main output of what we feel is our air conditioning. And he said, that is where your duct work also begins. We're going to take all that air and all that power and distribute it through the duct work the way that it's supposed to be distributed in the first duct. place. Duct. Duct. Yeah. There's. Duct. There's. Goose. <laughs> there's eight outputs in the front ceiling alone. And then we have a rear air conditioner as well, which we're not doing this on yet. If we like this, we'll do it. Um, so it's going to make the air coming out of those ducts, ducts uh, much more powerful, hence cooling the motorhome in a much more even way. All right. I have the cross. Are those the cross beams? <laughs> I have those up. Now we're going to start blocking it. Do I cover this? I must. I'm going to cover it right here. Just finishing up with the taping yeah, the last of the duct. The last strip going on. We have to make Would sure. this be duct tape? <laughs> Actually, it's not. It should be, though. Oh. Finishing putting on the cover. Okay. All Two. right. Okay, we're going to turn secure? it on and see how loud it sounds. Yes, Stay let's tuned. Try this thing. It just went on. We can talk. Oh, okay. This is cool. It's much stronger here. Oh, yeah. I can feel the air down on my face now, all the way down here. That's two and a half feet. Okay. Listen to that. This is good. Right there. I think it's gonna work. So grab yourself, grab yourself an RV AC silencer by Wacko. And if you have any questions, is this number there? No, here, if you have any questions. Right there. Call Daryl. Lila, what you asking for? Huh? I want. You know what she wants. What does she want? She wants an S T R O L L E R. She wants to go in her. But she had that today. She wants it again. Look who's over there. Who's got the pine cones? She in her pine cones. Who's got the pine cones? <laughs> Lila, Lila, Lila's like, can oh. we please? Oh. Oh, yeah, yeah. You're so excited, aren't you? Gracie? Look at Gracie's face. Gracie? <laughs> Gracie? Is that the oh, record number of pine God. cones in your mouth? <laughs> Look at them all. Oh, that's so funny. She's like, don't video me. I'm camera shy. Oh, Lila's so excited. Lila doesn't rip about the pine cones. Well, thanks so much for watching our videos, for following our channel. Please hit the, the subscribe button. It is free, 
doesn't cost anything and it helps support our channel. Um, what else? Hit the like button. See the little thumbs up below the video? Smash that like button. All right, you guys, thanks so much. Here's a last glimpse of RV journey. Uh, we leave this campground tomorrow. It's been a fantastic month, and we appreciate you following our adventures. Wherever you go, whatever you do, have a safe RV journey.